welcome viewers if still you're not subscribed to this channel kindly subscribe and also click the bell icon to get technology updates regularly on this JP Infotech channel hi in this video we are going to see about a Java web application project which is entitled as hotel management system or hotel room booking system so we have developed this project in Java NetBeans 8.2 ID NetBeans ID 8.2 and first load the project into the NetBeans ID so go to file menu and click open project select the source code location and click open project and kindly wait till the complete project is loaded and also make sure that you have already attached the MySQL database in the MySQL administrator and also this project has some mail sending options so you should turn off your firewall and antivirus because in case if you are not turning off your firewall or antivirus the mail sending option will not be working because it will be blocking those process so let me turn off my antivirus now coming back to the NetBeans ID 8.2 you can see the project is completely loaded and just right click the Hopal management system and select run and it takes few minutes to to take into the browser and now you can see the welcome screen or the home screen of the project with the project title hotel management system and hotel booking system and here you can see the book room option admin login option and contact option first we'll go for the book room so in the book room you can see the users who come to the system that is hotel management system they can able to see the available rooms and rates so you can see the room details here like deluxe room luxury room guest house single room double room and you can see the cost of it and in case if you wanted uh, add some rooms you wanted to this is for the admin part so admin should go to the admin login and enter the details of the admin credentials and once the login is success you can see the welcome screen of the admin so here in the admin they have the options of adding the rooms checking the available rooms room booking message and logout so let us see one by one everything so first we'll go for the add rooms as i said earlier if you wanted to add some room that admin can be able to add the room so before that let me download some image for it Now let me add the room type as suit room and number of rooms is 5 and cost let me enter it as 5000 rupees and let me upload this image and here you can preview that image and just click submit. And once after clicking submit you can just go to the available rooms and here you can check what all the available rooms available and you can see the suit room option which we added is also updated here in case if you may want to make some corrections here you can able to edit it by in case if you wanted to increase the room or in case if you wanted to add some cost for it you can do it and then click submit and here you can see now it has been updated and when we log out and come back to the user part there in the you can see the suit room is added here so earlier there was 
five rooms and type four room types and here you can see this now the suit room type is also been added here so in the user part if the user wanted to book a room for example to say let me book a suit room so when i click book room so it asks for the check-in date so for example let me select the date as 15 sorry 15 6 2021 and then select check availability and as the rooms are available you can able to book the room so let me enter my the details for booking the room so here you need to enter your uh, exact email id where the email will be sent once the room has been confirmed So you can select which type of uh, bedding type you needed and the number of rooms you require and here you can see uh, this is mentioned as six because as I have in admin part there are only six rooms available you cannot enter more than that so in case if you are entering and booking that it cannot book so let me show you that also so you can select the meal plan and what is the checkout date And here you can see the maximum available rooms is mentioned but let me click book and here you can see the value must be less than or equal to six because there are only six rooms available so let me book all the six rooms so automatically the cost will be calculated here and it is shown in this total cost here and now let me click book room so here you can see the room is booked successfully and click ok and once the room is booked so the admin should give a confirmation for booking so let me go to the admin part login and click login and once the login is success here you can go for the room bookings part so in the room bookings you can see who are all the users who have applied for the room booking so here you can see the last user that is the Jay Prakash which I have booked for the suit room so here you can see the room types suit room and six rooms and the details of check-in and check-out time everything is given and here you can see it is waiting stage because it is not at confirmed from the hotel people side so let me give approve now so once the approved is given you can see the booking is been approved and also just me, let me log out from the admin part and now here in the user part the user gets the email so let me go to my email id so here you can see in my email id i have received the email stating that hi jay prakash your room booking is been approved okay so the other option for the user side is like in case if i am again going to the suit room and let me select the same date say example 15 6 2021 and selecting check availability and here you can see now no suit rooms available at because all the rooms have been already booked all the six rooms which is available has already booked so once if you wanted to change the date and check it out you can check it out for example let me select 17 and check availability and you can see the details of the room booking again here and one in case if you wanted to contact the uh, hotel person for any kind of reason you can just go to this contact option here you can enter your name email id and you can enter the message hi sir i need some more rooms and you can just select send message option so here you can see the message is sent successfully and click ok now let me go to the admin part so in the admin part once there's a login is success you can just go to this message option here you can see the customer messages so here you can see the lost message that is Jay Prakash which I entered that is hi sir I need some more rooms and you can see the receive date and time of it 
and this is all about the project hotel management system or hotel room booking system in java and thank you for watching